Good day, everybody. Today we are going to work on inverse of a function. Show the functions f of x equal to 3x minus 2 and g of x equal to x plus 2 divided by 3 are inverses. So let's work with the first function f of x is equal to 3x minus 2. That means f of x is a function of x. We can write it as y equal to 3x minus 2. In order to find inverses, in order to find the inverse function, substitute x for y and y for x in the given function. In the given function and solve for y. And solve for y. So <clears throat> what they're saying is basically in the original function where x appears, make it y, and y, y appears, make it x, then we'll solve for y. So uh, the original function becomes Now, please uh, do not quit right away. Please watch this video until the end. This is a short video, and I'll give you an important hint or tip at the end of this program. Also, please subscribe to my channel, Math Science Topia, where I've solved all kinds of algebra problem in algebra problems full uh, playlist, okay? So, so the original function becomes, I'm going to substitute for y, x, and for x, y, then I have to solve for y. So in order to do that, I will add 2 on both sides because I will separate 3y from the constant term minus 2. So I get x plus 2 is equal to 3y. Now I have to solve for y. So I'll divide by 3 on both sides. Okay. And... Move this a little bit up. So this becomes 3 and 3 cancels on the right hand side. We have y is equal to x plus 2 by 3. So y equal to x plus 2 by 3. Okay. Which is the same as the second function. which is same as g of x. Okay. So original function becomes, so hence, I can write it over here, hence f of x and g of x are inverses. So let me give you an important hint. Or tip, the hint or tip is in the original function f of x 3x minus 2 equal to 3x minus 2. To find the inverse, I will substitute for y x and for x y. So original function is y equal to 3x minus 2. For y, I will write x equal to 3y minus 2. And then I solve for y, which is x plus 2 by divided by 3 which is same as the function g of x. Hence, I have shown f of x and g of x are inverses. If you have any question, comment, write me a note. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you like this video, share with your friends. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. So you and your friends, please subscribe to my channel, Math Science Topia, where I've solved all kinds of algebra problems just for you. 
please check out my playlist algebra problems in the channel math science topia thanks for watching have a nice day and please do not forget to visit my channel tomorrow again when i'll solve another algebra problem just for you thanks for watching take care have a nice day see you next time